Hi there! Again, this is Sir Visio, giving you bits of random learning bites. In this video, I will be talking about Zotero. This is a platform which is useful in writing your manuscript, your research manuscript, which requires referencing, which requires bibliography, and the sources of your statements. So, on your web browser, Chrome, you can search for Zotero in the downloads. Just click downloads. Then click download for the Zotero for Windows. While waiting for the download to complete, you can click the uh, plugin, install Chrome connector for Zotero. This is a plugin to be added to your Chrome browser. Then once you add that plugin, you can see on the upper right portion of your browser, there is this Zotero connector. Okay, this uh, icon. It's a, a folder or a paper icon. Then, if the download is complete, you can extract the file and just install it. Okay, just click the usual, the next. Okay, next. And the standard installation, just click and next install the software after installing the software this will run around one or two minutes only but of course depending on your system okay just click finish and launch Zotero okay once you launch Zotero the Zotero window will pop up and on that window, you can see on the upper left portion, there's this folder. And then you can create new folder. For example, I will create a new folder for my research this year. Say, thesis. I will create a folder name, uh, thesis 2021. Click OK. Ah. Then you can see there's my folder named thesis 2021 now we will start searching for some references a google scholar i will search for some interesting topics say i will search for something related to agriculture physics okay say i like this one okay. then it will start downloading oh this is a pdf file Okay, since this is a PDF file, on the Zotero icon, you will see a PDF icon there. That means this is connecting to a PDF link. Then I will save it into the Thesis 2021 folder. Because on my Zotero window, I click the Thesis 2021 folder. Okay, then I will search for another topic. Say uh, this one. Okay. Again, this is saved in the Thesis 2021 folder. Then I will search for another. Say this is a book. Okay, Agricultural Physics. This is first edition. Okay, say I will click this one. Again, I will add this into my 2021, uh, Thesis 2021 folder. Say I already have my references, the needed sources for my write-up. Then I will write using my uh, Microsoft Word uh, processor. In the Microsoft Word processor, once you had installed Zotero, you will see a tab on your Windows. There's the Zotero tab. Say I will write something uh, on my manuscript. 
Then I will add a citation and I will choose APA. Okay, then click OK. Then I will choose which of my sources. Then hit enter. Okay, so it will automatically add the source of my uh, statements. Then I will have another paragraph. Then add another uh, reference or source of that uh, statement. Okay, again, I will click Zotero and add citation. Then type the book title or the article title or the author. Then click. Then hit enter. Then it will again input the reference or the source of that statement for another paragraph okay i will add again my source say this is the source of that statement which is this uh, and i hit enter okay so all of my statements are with appropriate sources then at the end of my manuscript of course i will put my bibliography zotero will do the bibliography for me everything all the sources i've mentioned in my manuscript zotero will incorporate those sources in my references say i will have a references at the end of my manuscript then I will just add, okay, again clicking Zotero, I will add bibliography. Then Zotero will insert everything. Say for example, uh, I must change. There are informations in my sources which I need to change. For example, this book. In the Zotero file, when I downloaded the book, there was no author so by the by this time say i i already know the author of this book then i will change say for example this is family name and the first name is uh, first name okay then enter so before updating my bibliography or the references, there's no author for this particular book, the Agricultural Physics, no uh, first edition. There's no author name. But when I refresh my bibliography in Zotero, I will click refresh, it will automatically rearrange my bibliography or my references and it will reflect now the name of the author okay so that's it that's basically it i hope you find this video useful especially in writing your manuscripts again this is service you at your service giving you bits of random learning bytes